hello friends most welcome to my youtube channel in this video we will discuss about the elements of language actually there are about five elements of language namely phonetics and phonology morphology syntax semantics and pragmatics these elements are commonly referred to as linguistic elements and there are fundamental components that shape and define a language system. They encompass various linguistic aspects including sounds, words, sentence structure, meaning and language use in communication. First of all, we will discuss phonetics and phonology. Phonetics and phonology will be discussed separately. Okay, number first is phonetics. Phonetic studies the physical properties and production of speech sounds. It examines the articulatory, acoustic, and auditory aspects of human speech. Actually, there are three main branches of phonetics. Number first is articulatory phonetics. It studies the articulation, or we can say the production of speech sounds. Number second is acoustic phonetics. It studies the transmission of speech sounds from speaker to the listener. And the third one is auditory phonetics. It studies the perception and comprehension of speech sounds by the human senses and mind respectively. Okay, now here we have phonology. Phonology deals with the organization and patterns of sounds in a particular language. It studies the way sounds function and our structure within a language focusing on sound patterns, phonemes, and phonological rules. For instance, in English, the P and B sounds are considered the distinct phonemes because they can change the meaning of words, for example, the word pet versus the word bait. Okay, the second element of language is morphology. Morphology analyzes the structure and formation of words. It investigates how words are composed of smaller units called morphemes, which carry meaning. For example, in the word unhappiness, there are about three morphemes. First is un, the second is happy, and the third one is ness. And each morpheme contributes to the words overall meaning. Okay, the third element of language is syntax. So what is syntax? Syntax is concerned with the arrangement and organization of words to form grammatically correct sentences. It focuses on the rules governing sentence structure, word order, and praise formation. For instance, for instance the sentence the cat chased the dog follow the subject verb object word order commonly found in english okay the fourth element of language is semantics semantics deals with the meaning of words phrases and sentences it examines how words and combination of words convey meaning and how meaning is interpreted within different contexts for example the word dog refers to a four-legged animal while the word bark can refer to the sound a dog makes or the outer covering of a tree. Okay, the fifth element of language is pragmatics. Pragmatic focuses on the use of language in specific social and cultural contexts. It examines how language is used to convey meaning beyond a literal interpretation considering factors such as context, speaker intentions and implications. For example, saying, could you please close the window, is a request rather than a literal question demonstrates an understanding of a pragmatic language use. Okay, these five elements work together to form a complex system of communication in any language. Understanding and studying these elements helps linguists and researchers analyze and explain their structure, meaning, and use of language in different contexts. Okay, thanks for watching the video and please do not forget to subscribe my YouTube channel. And if you have any question or any confusion, you can message us on Instagram.